Hi, I'm Desling Darrell from Bunbury Farmers Market where we have extreme value and extreme freshness. And I'm Terrific Terry. And Daryl's got some cauliflowers here today. That's right, I'm doing a really nice little entree or appetizer, great okay. for picnics, cauliflower tidbits. Cauliflower tidbits? That's right, beautiful Terry, very, very easy. Okay, I've got a cup of self-raising flour, yes. half a teaspoon of baking powder, just to give it that little bit of rise. lightness. Yes. Put that in the bowl, uh -huh. just make a little well in the middle, yep. and one beaten egg, one beaten put that in there, egg. yep. And we've got chives. Chopped chives gives it a nice flavour. Mm -hmm. About uh, a bunch of chives, or you can use spring onions if you don't have chives. A pinch of salt and pepper. There we mm. go. And some water. We've got a cup, a cup approximately a cup of water. Just see how it goes, whether we need to add more or less. Okay. Sort of a bit like a batter texture. Okay, yes. Give it a mix. Radio. Through. That's mm. it. Look at it. Beautiful. And then. Uh -huh. The parmesan, grated parmesan, yes. just gives it a nice little, um, a little tang. Bit of a bite. Tip that in there, mix it through. Away you go. This is so easy. You know, you can use any any veggie, cooked sweet yep. potato, or uh -huh. even if you've cauliflowers left over from the yep. night before. Great way to use it yeah. up. So really, really good. This cauliflower has been steamed till it's a bit tender. That's right. Yep. Two cups. Just tip it in there. Straight in the batter. Simple. Mm -hmm. Quick mix through. Like so, mix it up, look at that, yeah. beautiful. That is very easy, Daryl. It is, simple. I, I could even do that, Daryl. <laughs> That's right. Might just put a tiny little bit more water to that. Just a, a little, little yeah. bit more. Yeah, okay. Mix just that through for us, That's great. Yeah. All right, I can yeah. see what you're Yeah, sort of yeah. a little bit yeah. better yep. texture yep. and what yep. have you. See, have a look at that. Just nice. Mm -hmm. See, it's glistening too. Beautiful. Yeah. But that, it's that. hugging each individual it is. flower That's, red as well. Yeah. Too. Okay. Use a, a delicate olive oil in this. Okay. Um, anything stronger is too full too on much. flavour. Yeah. So we're going to turn the um, pan on, get that mm -hmm. going. Okay. There we go. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. There we go. That's done there. And then you get your spoon. Just little. Okay. And just to note that Daryl did have the oil heated up before. You have to put it into warm oil. You That's can't right. put it into cold. That's right. Yeah. Not too hot, Terry, because you've yep. got to allow it to um, cook through. Yep. Just a spoon around. Mm hmm Just so you get that nice little rough sort of texture yep. to it. Right. Don't put too many in at once. Well, yeah. You want to be able to That's turn right. them too, don't That's you? That's right. Yep. And then they'll start to float a little bit shortly to the top. Yep. And then once they float a bit, then you turn them over. Okay. I've got some um, baking paper, some paper towel on there. That's to drain, to drain them. them. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. They're nearly ready to okay. turn. Just let them brown on one side the first. Tiny little golden right. hint of brown. Yes. These are beautiful. You can even do them with sweet corn. Yeah, actually, I've made some ones with sweet oh, corn. Have you? Oh, good. Very nice. These are good for picnics too, Terry. You can call them corn fritters. Oh, okay. And you can use fruit too, but you use a different batter. That's right, mm. yes. Let's we'll turn that just to seal that. Yeah. And then we'll have one more turn in a minute just yeah. to brown it off. Yes. Just about there. Oh, they look lovely, they don't look good. they? Yeah, very, very nice. You've got the green little flecks yeah. of chives in there, or you can use the spring onions, of course. Mm -hmm. So that's yep. nearly there. Just got to get a bit more colour to them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If your oil's too hot, they won't cook in the middle. Yeah, so yeah. you'll have a nice crispy outside, That's, but a, a doughy yeah, inside, doughy and you just side, don't yeah. want that. Yeah. You can do them in a wok. Yeah. If you do them in a wok, that sort of they cook a little bit quicker in the wok. Okay. But I like it the pan. You get that nice little yeah. flat sides and a little yes. crinkle on the edge of that. It's just about mm. done there. Yeah, they're looking very nice. Yeah. Nice golden brown colour. Uh huh. These are great if you you can do them small. If you're having a cocktail party, do little tiny ones. Okay, yeah. Um, I like these because they're a good entree um, sort of size. Oh, well, you could pack them up and take them out on a picnic with That's you as right. well. That's yeah. right, exactly. That's just about there. I'll start taking them out now. That one's ready to go. 
Let them drain well on the um, paper towel. And the parmesan, the flavour will be beautiful with mm -hmm. the parmesan. There we go. That's about right there. Turn that off. Look at them, they look beautiful. They do. Really good. There we go. And that's the last one there. Uh -huh. They're ready to go. And right. yep, just turn them over, drain, just to dab any of the little bits of oil. Yep. Just flick them over like so. And then we'll put them on the plate. Nice serving plate. Nice little garnish there, Terry. I almost wish I had a prawn in there. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. That's and great. you know, the best thing to serve it with, look at that, that's good. Crunch preserves, ah. Bustleton made. Beautiful product. I've got the tomato one there. That is a wise choice. And I'll just put a little bit on work. the side there for you. Just a nice little bit there, just on the side Smart. there. Or you can have a little sauce, um, sauce dish to put it in. Yep. There we go. You can season the outside with salt, depending mm -hmm. on if you like the salt. So mm. have a try of that, Terry. I will. Thank you, Daryl. Very hot. Yes. I guess they would be coming out of the oil. They smell good. Oh, they do. Tell you what. Mm. Oh. Isn't it? Oh, Daryl. That's completely changed the way you perceive cauliflower. That's right. Almost um, has a creamy texture, it doesn't does. it? It's, it's it does. Right. It's fluffy. It's really light. Velvety. Really fluffy. It's beautiful, Daryl. Daryl, it is absolutely fabulous. So come into Bunbury Farmers Market. We're open seven days a week. All our beautiful fresh produce straight from our grower to yours.